Okay, it looks like I'm not wearing a top, but I swear that I am. But today's video, I'm gonna try to do an outfit and makeup inspired by Ice Spice. I think she's like so cute. And I'm really loving her verse on Pink Panthers. And I know people might hate me for not knowing about her before Pink Panthers, but but I've been looking at her like her outfits and her makeup, and it seems like she kind of has the same makeup a lot of the time. It's very bronzy, it's very kind of natural, and of course it has like lined lip and like gloss. So I think I'd kind of try transform myself and also have an outfit kind of inspired by her but also so kind of pertaining to mine hence the cow print we'll get to it later i'm also trying to simultaneously film a tiktok doing this makeup look but uh, we'll see how it goes because it usually goes pretty bad i think i'm gonna put my phone like on my windowsill i'm like looking at two different look that's my phone okay i don't know if that even caught that okay so, I actually bought primer, so I'm gonna use my primer and prime my face. I usually don't use primer, but I was like, I should start using primer for my face. I also tried the Meredith Beauty Foundation thing, a uh, method, and I literally wasted all of my foundation I was left, but I forgot I had an LA Colors foundation, so I guess we're good. Okay, we're gonna focus on my face. So, after I prime that, I'm gonna take my concealer, my color correcting concealer. So she has really like glowy base and I think that's kind of what I'm gonna focus on for this look. She doesn't use eyeliner either, which is something I'm not used to. And when I posted a TikTok using this foundation, people were so mad. They're like, that's not your foundation. I mean, that's not your concealer shade. And I'm like, it's, have you guys literally never heard of color correcting? And that's a little concerning. Okay, so I'm just gonna blend it in and I know I put a lot and it looks like there's no rhyme or reason and you're right There isn't my stick foundation and I'm gonna make sure that I'm gonna I'm like trying to multitask like I'm literally trying to film a tiktok through this and I'm listening to Nick is not green right now but I'm erasing my eyebrows basically. I haven't really been using a beauty blender to blend out my makeup. I've kind of been liking this brush that I got from Santi Alley, but I don't know. I don't know if I see a difference. I'm just also lazy to just like wet the, the sponge. I know that's so bad, but now I'm gonna take my Wet n Wild concealer and then actually conceal the under eyes with my shade. Okay, obviously I'm missing a very key component of this look, which is eyebrows, and I don't feel like if I draw them in, they're gonna look any better, so. This is why it's inspired, I spice kind of look, okay? But I love my no eyebrows, so I'm gonna keep that there. So I think we're gonna, like, do a lot of under foundation stuff, so it kind of looks like we're glowing from the inside. I'm gonna take my LA Colors Illuminating Enhancer, so it's kind of like a blush and a highlight, and we're gonna have to like bronze our face a lot because she has really like bronze kind of look going on so this is in the shade aura and i just put it on the like this part of my face so i'm gonna take my angled brush and just pat it in i feel like i put too much on this side but we're gonna blend it out anyway it's very glowy which i like got some on my headphones my headphones are literally so dirty okay like i said we're gonna do bronze like a very shiny bronze so i think i'm gonna take a mixture of this shade and a mixture of this shade so ilium and rosa from my valfrey palette which has been through the ringer obviously so i'm gonna take this kind of rounded brush and then just pat pat here so i have quite a bit of it on and i'm just gonna go here so now i'm gonna take my foundation and i'm just gonna go put foundation all over my face it's just my la colors um foundation and warm honey this is the only foundation i have left and i'm even running out so no bueno okay now we're gonna repeat but with a little less this time because we want it to be like still natural but glowy on the outside. So I'm just going to put a couple drops of the limiting drops one more time. So I'm just going to put two. And then we're going to pat pat again. Alright, so I'm just going to go in with this shade this time. And then we're going to take the other shade. Ice coffee break. And we're going to go in with this white shade. 
it's very subtle but she has a very natural look to her but this just kind of opens the eyes I feel like a little more and plus I'm too lazy to find my white eyeliner so I'm gonna take my elf finishing powder and we're gonna finish the face because we're pretty much done with it I got my elf brush then I'm just gonna lightly put this shadow on it's like a warm brown one in happy hour and just put it on here I'm going to take this flat brush and blend it out because it looks literally insane. And then I'm going to get this lighter color called We Love Brunch and literally just put it all over my lid. She has the tiniest baby wing that's more like kind of smeared, if you know what I'm talking about, a little smudged. But the tiniest baby wing. So we're going to take my pencil liner and we're going to draw it. Okay, we need to like make sure this isn't so harsh because it's a literally the smallest wing ever. Like a little, like a little tiny tail. So, we're almost done. So now we're gonna line my lips with this cream shop lipstick in the shade Brooklyn and it's a very like brown shade and I feel like it's perfect for this and we're gonna put a gloss over it. So I'm gonna take a small brush and get some of it on it so I can line my lips. So now I'm gonna take my e.l.f. lip gloss, my lip lacquer, and love bite, and I'm gonna go over it in my lips. Okay, I'm gonna put on my lashes, and then I'm gonna put on my wig, and then we'll see the final look. Okay, this is the outfit. I feel like I Spice wears a lot of streetwear, obviously, and from what I've seen on Pinterest, she wears a lot of crop tops, and I thought I'd be inspired by her, but still keep my cow print, because obviously, you can't tell I love cow prints. And then I'm wearing this kind of sporty um, skirt because I'm also going to the gym later. So I was like, maybe I'll just wear something that's a little easy for me to wear. I hate waste wasting outfits. Okay, I think that's better. So this tube top is from Depop. I got it during the quarantine. It was probably like $10, but it's probably drop ship, honestly, because there's no brand on it. And then these... The skirt is from Rift when I used to work at Crossroads, but they have shorts under it, so I think it's really cute. It's very comfortable, very casual, but it's very cute. Um, I think this is from Shein, honestly. I think it's also for five dollars at Crossroads, though. So, and then I'm wearing my brand dead socks, also in cow print. I think it's so cute. I got these maybe a year ago. And they're still my favorite pair of socks and obviously they match with my cow print top and then for shoes she wears like obviously like nike and air jordans but i'm not really a sneaker head but this is the only shoe i have which is air forces i know it's so lame but i don't really think they match with the outfit so i was like i thought i'd match it or break out my feelers i don't know why i said match with my feelers and i think it'd be a really cute outfit so i'm gonna put these on real quick I can't get myself in the picture, but this is the full fit, like in the corner of my room. I just realized I didn't show the final makeup look. I just kind of went straight into the outfit, but this is how it came out. I think it's very cute. It's very um, natural, kind of, and I think it's really pretty. I I feel like I do my makeup like this sometimes, but not really. I like to do like graphic stuff, but I think this is really cute for the look and outfit. It's very chill. Alright, so that's the end of this video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think. I really love Ice Spice's style and stuff. And I'm glad she's like popping off. And I'm glad I was able to find her. Um, but yeah, so thank you for watching. And I'll see you next video. Bye. You say you can't feel a single thing. Say you didn't feel it when you kissed me. Why you